Crossfire.friends, Earl of the Logbook.com, back to play a game of Blueprint. This is the Atari 2600 version that, uh, last time the whole family was gathered around an actual 2600, uh, this was a favorite of my, uh, my oldest, but not for that reason. <laughs> And not for that reason. I should have paid more attention to where the uh, pieces went. Unlike the arcade game, I didn't even mean to go in that house, but there you go. Um, the arcade game doesn't necessarily require you to put the pieces on the blueprint in a specific order. Uh, this game does require that of you, this version of the game. figure out the timing on this. Alright. So I killed the monster. Ugh. Yeah, it's the one thing I kind of greatly dislike about this port is it is so finicky about what order you put everything in. I have a feeling it's going to get the girl. It got the girl. My game is over. Sorry, sweetheart. Obviously, you're trying to uh, keep the monster from getting your girl. Um, something that I am accomplishing only very intermittently.
think I can remember where they all went. up a bullfrog. I appear to have picked up another bullfrog. You can use the action button to speed up uh, your bomb disposal, but uh, much like the arcade game, the fast run ability is uh, something that lasts only very fleetingly. like the life of this poor damsel I'm trying to rescue. Alright. Let's do it again. better than that. Alright, now I think it's going to take all the pieces. Okay, so the bottom two houses are to be avoided completely. Much like that monster, which I just failed to avoid. A nice little port in its own way. Um, I remember as a kid, I was perfectly happy playing this. Whereas I only saw the arcade game in person once in one venue. And not for very long. So, most of my blueprint playing experience is with this and not the coin-op. And it's... Um, it's fine for what it is. Uh, could be a little bit truer to the inspiration, though. 